extraction efficiency be determined by the chimney gas exhaust temperature exactly right always learning and you have to remember that so we're talking about he's saying which is right you know the how much heat is left in the chimney exhaust when it comes out is how you can tell how efficient your heat extraction was ideally that's going to be you know if you could get all of the heat out it would just be coming out at room temperature um, if you were even better than you know efficient you could get it at cook send it out cold if you were using some kind of powered system but um but yes always learning that is the ultimate measure but when we talk about a system whether it's capable of heat extraction or whatever there's more to it than just what's the temperature coming out of the chimney because you know i can build that big bare half barrel system that has bare half barrels all over the place and we can light it up and uh, no smoke's gonna come out the chimney. <laughs> all the smoke is gonna be cold and condensed and it's gonna pour out all of my gaps at floor level. But if you were to measure that smoke, and I've done this, not there, but I've measured like a crazy smoky burn in my chimney with a Testo, and you get amazing efficiency numbers. Like you get the highest numbers you can ever get when the thing is just, choking on wet cold smoke because it's extracted all the heat and the reason it's choking on wet cold smoke is because it's making that smoke because it doesn't have enough draft to fire the front end to burn cleanly because you've taken too much heat out of the chimney and you have no draw and so it's just smoldering away in the front and slowly smoldering that smoke through the exhaust and you take all the heat out of the smoke it's super efficient <laughs> but it's an absolute disaster so this is a good example of how the whole thing's a system how it all needs to be looked at you know as a system um, everything affecting everything else and you can't just take things like overall efficiency as the end-all be-all um, because I could certainly give you an amazing testo run that you wouldn't know Peter would know some some people would know but I could show you great numbers from a burn that was just blowing black smoke, you know? Um, so keep that stuff in mind when we talk about these things. So when we talk about heat extraction efficiency, what we're really talking about, <clears throat> when I'm saying it, when I'm talking about a system, I'm talking about your whole system, your whole heater, your whole stove, and how much heat it can extract from the exhaust and still run efficiently. And of course, that's going to change day to day, right? Like if it's really cold out, you're going to be able to take a lot more heat out of the exhaust than you can on a really warm day. Um, so keep all those things.